sprinkled them in here and there. I was off today though, but it was a long day. I was outside all day and my hair was straight. Now it's frizzy and gross because it was like 90 degrees outside today. I was in the sun. You can see I have kind of rosy, rosiness on my face. Um, but I wanted to do a little summer favorites, kind of like be that it girl summer and just show you kind of my favorites right now. Things that I kind of went into the summer with. Um, almost everything can be found on Amazon. I, um, I made a summer favorites folder or list on my Amazon storefront. Um, so you can check that out. My storefront is always linked down below if you're curious and seeing some of these things. Um, Another thing that maybe, like I didn't buy on Amazon, you can kind of buy anywhere. So let's just get into it. So let's start with sunscreen. And I'm not going to talk about it too, too much. But I have a couple of different types of sunscreen for different purposes. This one I briefly talked about. This is the Sun Bum Face Mist. This I did order on Amazon, but you could get it at CVS or any drugstore. Um, it's SPF 45. And now my reason for this, I really like this for days where I may put a little bit of makeup on to go to the beach. Um, or like the pool, the pool club or whatever. Um, sometimes, yes, I am that person. I will admit it. Sometimes I don't put makeup on. Sometimes I do. If I'm doing a beach day with a bunch of friends, I'll probably put like some BB cream on and fill in my brows and stuff like that. So when I do that, this comes in handy because there's nothing worse than having BB cream or something on your face and then having to spread like a regular sunscreen on top of that and putting it under. It just makes you greasy. It's just not good. Whereas this, I'll just spray it all over my face on top of whatever I have on my face and I don't have to like blend it in or rub it in and smudge anything. You just spray it on. So, Sun Bum Face Mist, 10 out of 10. This is actually, like, this is not just one of those things like buy it just to buy it. It actually has like a really good purpose. So, um, I mentioned this in a, a previous video and I got a, a couple of questions about it. So, um, I think I linked it on my Amazon storefront. If I didn't, I will. Um, all this stuff, 10 out of 10. My regular sunscreen, I'm not going to talk too much about, but this is my favorite. It's the Hawaiian Tropic SPF 15. I will only use 15 once I already have a base tan, which I do already, as you can see. Um, so now I'm in the clear to wear 15. You do have to reapply it somewhat regularly because 15 isn't a lot. But my skin is, is good once I have that base layer. I'm like, I'm good. Um, but the reason that this is my favorite um, is because this Hawaiian Tropic is the Hawaiian Tropic Sheer Touch. And it has almost like shimmer in it. I think it's, it says it's radiant. It leaves skin radiant. It leaves like almost like sparkles all over your skin. And it's really pretty. So, I don't know. It just makes me feel like that girl, you know? So, Hawaiian Tropic. Radiant touch. Or light, sheer touch, whatever. You get it. It's really good. And then, this I use on a daily basis. When I, even when I'm going to work or hanging out with friends or whatever. This is the Super Goop Glow Screen. It is SPF 40. This is very popular on like TikTok and just in the makeup beauty world. Super Goop is not cheap. <laughs> it's expensive. This little bottle, I don't remember how much it was. I got it on Amazon as like a, a tester, you know, because I wasn't sure if I was going to like it. And it turns out I really do like it, but even this little bottle, I forgot how much it was, but it was not, it was not cheap at all. You would think something like this would be like, 
second and I want to show you this I discovered this from some girl on TikTok her name is Isabel I don't know her last name or I'm pretty sure her username is just Isabel uh, Isabel with like two angel emojis anyway I was watching one of her get ready with me videos a couple weeks ago and she used this and this is a blush it's a liquid blush but if you if you see it's clear slash this like greenish color so basically what it does I'll show you it's supposed to bring out the natural pH of your skin so you put it on and it like turns pink it looks better on on your face um, but it's supposed to bring out whoa the lighting got really weird I look like I'm underwater um, but yeah it like settles in and it starts to it looks like pink it's really hard to see in this lighting but it is really good and I like it because it leaves it does leave like a little shimmer which is really nice again for summertime so this is it says this is not English Silro Fuller I don't know it's a really weird probably a little sketchy Amazon find but I put it in my summer favorites folder should you want to try it it wasn't expensive um I like the way it looks so I don't know okay um I will show you this next
this is a Povoy ring. This came in a set, which I don't remember. And then these are, these I found on a small boutique on Instagram. But yeah, these two rings and the necklaces and eight earrings actually are all Amazon. You know, I'm an Amazon girly. Um, okay, the last three things that I will share with you are new purchases, but they're really good. So you guys know I don't have straight hair. This is not my natural hair. I have very wavy, very frizzy, textured hair, where like sometimes it'll be curly, sometimes it'll just be wavy. It's, it's a little bit of everything, and it is very, very, very dependent on the weather. But in the summertime, when it's really hot and I'm going to the pool and the beach, I don't have time nor patience to always straighten my hair. But I normally, I just don't like my natural hair, especially at my length right now. I just, it's just not my favorite. But I have found some products that are changing that a little bit. Um, what I would do before is I would not brush my hair in the shower or when I go out of the shower. And then I would put mousse in it, a little bit of hair oil, and then hairspray once it started to dry. And it was okay, but it left my hair kind of like crunchy and just looking wet. You know, that wet look that was very in when I was like 12 and 13 years old in middle school. That was like the look. It is no longer the look, rightfully so. Um, I just noticed that my neck got sunburned today. I'm sorry, that just caught my attention. Anyway, um, you know, that's not cute crunchy, crunchy wet look. Um, at least it's not cute on me. So I found this trend going around again on TikTok. TikTok, you know, has a lot of downfalls, but it's also useful a lot of the time. Um, not a lot of the time, sometimes. Anyway, um, this girl created a trend and everybody was trying it. I forgot her name, but this was her regimen for letting her hair dry natural and she would say, no matter what your hair texture, no matter, you know, whatever, these products will make your hair look good. So, these two products are by Not Your Mother's. I use their dry shampoo a lot, and that's really good. But that's all I've used from them. So, the first step after the shower while your hair is still wet is to put on the Curl Talk. Both of these are the Curl Talk um, line. Um, this is the Curl Talk Defining Cream. It says lock in moisture, defrizz, and add shine to define your true curls. It says for all curl types, create maximized definition with lasting elasticity and shine. Seal in moisture and eliminate frizz while providing manageable, lustrous locks that enhance your natural curls. So that's step one. Then you're going to go in with the mousse. So this is activating Curl Talk mousse. And this is the soft, touchable hold, like on the scale of like soft, stiff. Um, it's number two out of five, again, for all curl types. And the, both of these are cruelty free, gluten free, silicone free, alcohol free. And you can recycle the can. <laughs> so it says keeps curls beautifully defined and bouncy with a light, touchable hold. Long-lasting protection against humidity helps your curls hold their shape and move freely. Nothing can stop them now. But just with these two things, my hair just, it just doesn't work. No matter what, my hair will frizz. It just is what it is, unless I put hairspray or something to really, like, cement it down. And that is where the next product comes in handy. This is, and I think this is what makes it, this is the Kinky Curly Original Curling Custard. Um, it's natural styling gel. This is what it looks like. Ignore the Target sticker. I just could not get it off. But yeah, this is what holds everything together. And I will also, before this, put a little bit of hair oil. I don't think it matters what hair oil. Um, but just something to make it a little shiny and a little more moisturized. And then this kind of cements it down. And all these products smell amazing. Um, my 
CVS didn't have the Girl Talk stuff. That's where I went first. They didn't have it. I went on Amazon and it was either ridiculously expensive or you had to buy a pack of like four of them and I just didn't want to do that. Um, so I ordered all three of them from Target. Normally I wouldn't order things from Target, but I have just had no time to get to Target. So I ordered it from Target. All three things, if you're curious. Um, but it works, you know, if it works, it works. So these are all things that I have been loving right now. Um, I will have links for you down below. The hair products, not so much, because again, you can find that most places or just look it up. But the other fun things are on my Amazon storefront, so you guys can go check that out if you so wish. But that is all I have to share with you today. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching and for hanging out with me today, and I will see you in my next video.